Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a get ready with me and I'm going to share with you what I do for my quick makeup look for work. Um, now I don't like to get a full face. Well, I don't really do a full face but if I do want like more than four products on my face that takes more time. So I'm pretty a light makeup look that makes it look like I didn't do much. So if you want to see what my makeup look for work looks like then just keep on watching so for my moisturizer you always have to have a moisturizer I feel like it's the primer and first step to my routine I don't really use a primer anymore just because my skin is normal to dry so I use a moisturizer and make sure that it really moisturizes my skin so the first thing that I use is the elf holy hydration face cream I really love this this is the e.l.f. Holy Hydration Face Cream and it works really well for my skin. My skin is really sensitive, but somehow I don't break out to it, so that's great. So I just put it on and now I'm going to do my eyebrows and that is the L'Oreal Brow Stylist Definer in Ultra Fine. This is amazing. I love this eyebrow pencil. So I'm going to do these real quick. So as you can see, I'm filling in where I want my eyebrow to be placed from the top and the bottoms. I know a lot of people say um, not to do it at the top, but whatever works for you, honestly, makeup has no rules, especially if you are doing it for yourself, which you are. You should not be putting on makeup to impress others. So there is the first eyebrow. Okay guys, so next I'm using the Fenty Sunstalker bronzer. This is so light for me, um, but it's in my project pan and I'm so happy that I am expanding my pan. So first I'm going to chisel out my cheeks and give myself a natural base tan before the darker bronzer that I'm going to use. So first I'm going to chisel out my cheeks and make them look a little skinnier. And as you can see, it already is a little tan <laughs> so now I'm going to use my Becca Cosmetics bronzer this is the mini and this is in Capri Coast I'm using the minis first I want to use it up before I actually use the big ones so I am just fluffing out my cheeks to give it more dimension and lifting it up higher if I need to. As you can see, there's a little bit extra right there. So I'm going to... So now I'm going to use a uh, pale eyeshadow to cover up my dark eyelids. They are very dark lately, so I'm going to do that. And this is just a random pale color from a makeup palette. This is the Too Faced Hot Butter Rum palette that I got, I want to say, two years ago now. And I really do like it. I haven't used it much, but I'm trying to get some use out of it before I do a huge declutter. I have some makeup palettes that I've had for years and I don't use, so I'm trying to use these up and see what I like and what I don't like. So next I'm going to curl my lashes and do my mascara. The first mascara that I'm using is the L'Oreal Voluminous Original Mascara. I like this mascara because it is very lightweight and it's easier to take off every single night but it stays on all day. And then the next one I like is the L'Oreal Carbon Black Telescopic Mascara. This is really good because it does keep my lashes in place. It's almost like cement but it's very comfortable to wear. So. I'm going to do my eyelashes real quick. So now I'm going to do blush. And today's blush that I'm using is one from my weekly makeup basket. And this is the Georgia Blush from Benefit. Now, you guys know my cheeks are so sensitive. Once I touch this, my cheeks are going to flare up. I really like that this is glowy. So I don't need to add a highlighter. But obviously you can too. 
add more highlight to your face. I'm not going to put highlighter on my face because I am going to the gym today after work, so I just don't want the extra makeup. But now I'm going to fix my mascara. I think I need to do one more layer and then I should be good. So lastly, I just added my Tower 28 Lip Jelly and this is in the shade Cashew. This is a beautiful brownie nude. I've been loving it so much. It's just so easy and quick to put on. It is not sticky so you're not feeling like gross during the day and I really like it. So this is the final makeup look for work. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Everything will be linked in the description box. I will do links so you guys can just click on it and go to the website. It's a lot easier for you guys and I would like to help you out. I am not getting paid by having any of these links, so don't be afraid to purchase anything. It's just me being nice and helping you guys out. So, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.